Hello everyone, my name is Dustin Lentz, and welcome back to some more Dead Cells, where you might be able to tell that things aren't going swimmingly as of late, but um, they aren't terrible either, I would say. I still have no idea if and what is potentially going on with that door at all. We have the frantic sword again though, or spiteful sword again, which I've gone to state, I'm a pretty big fan of its moveset, other than the slightly low damage knockback, but you don't get the knockback for the damage, you get the knockback for the interrupts, which are all the more valuable, especially as you get further on in the game. <sighs> Impaler. Ah. There we go. Yep, and that's why you take the Impaler, because Impaler is just like such a good weapon. Sturdy shield. Nah. There we go, yeah. This is exactly why you pick up this weapon. Ooh! Uh, did I miss something? Yeah, I was gonna say, like, I'm pretty sure I was gonna miss something down here if I skip that. Skip that. Give, show me some more. Oh my god. Skip that. Send me to the floor. Skill upgrade. Not immediately useful, but it will show its worth in a few moments. In a mere amount of moments, one might even say. Like even right now. With this uh, fire grenade one. Nothing wrong with a fire grenade. Unless you're suffering from crippling amounts of forest fires like we currently are in BC here. What? No. But you, you don't understand. That guy did not actually hit me there. Uh, projectiles are reduced. Drops a bomb when you roll. If I was going to get an amulet, I think I'll take this one. Well, and that's just the promenade, which... I definitely don't need to go to the promenade. As long as I don't buy anything else, we should have enough money to... swing... Oh my god. Please, controller. Work with my hands here. I will admit, though, just like the base initial damage of the harpoon. Not blowing it out of the water, but once you get someone up against the wall, it's pretty good. Sure, we'll take it because it poisons enemies when you parry, which, come on, let's be honest, who's parrying these days? Uh, nothing there. Okay. Nothing over there. Is this to... Yeah, this will be to the ossuary. Which I just barely can't afford. Okay. Just remember that it's over there. And that I shouldn't be spending any more money. I really should just teleported. I really, really should just teleported here. I'm not sure of jump. Uh, I'm not sure of jumping while going up ladders and such is actually the right way to go. Sometimes it feels like the right thing to do, but then other times it's like definitely doesn't. 
Okay, yep, 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 yep. There we go. And that's just to the toxic sewers, which we have explored everything else. So we definitely will have enough money to go to the ossuary again, even though I don't feel very well equipped going down there. But hey, he who dares, does not try does not win. I just need to, like, check something here, though. Uh... What is this message saying? Okay. I'll have to read that more later. I have to begin pretty close to, yeah, it's like one more time successfully bringing cells back and then I'll be good to go. Uh, can't afford anything over there, not that any of that, other than maybe the fire torrent seems very good there. So, I hate to say it. But I think we're going to be relying somewhat heavily on Fire Grenade for the first little bit here. Seems how we don't have a lot of damage in the first place. And he is not dead from the initial blast. Oh! But he did have... Crazy jumps. No, no, up, 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 up. Uh, no, we'll go like that. Let them walk into the fire and flames. I know this is like the baby way of going about things, but I think you would take this approach as well if you were in my position. Nice little tidbit of gold. I threw that the wrong way. Now I have to deal with the consequences in that I have to wait longer now. Oh, jeez. Oh, I'm a rat stuck in a cage here right now. And then you are trapped up against... Oh, 2,700 gold for that. That is... Decent. Oh my god, look at the gold I'm getting now all of a sudden, though. That is pretty decent. Pretty decent. Wow. Wow. There we go. He did not die, like, quite as fast. So, oh, we need, like, a lot of good upgrades here. Which we are severely lacking. Thank God Fire Grenade is just so good, though. Oh, okay, get out, get out, get out. Before you're all dead from unnecessary fire and flames. Oh, that wasn't the right thing to do there. Perfect, okay. At least that attack is good for that at the very least. Perfect, okay, okay. Take it easy. Ooh. Slow rider. Okay, we are definitely not doing the thing down there for a freaking tonic. Ooh. 
Nope. Didn't quite land that one correctly either. There we go. That's how you land it. Do the deed like that. What is the deed, you might ask? Well, that is a question for your parents when you're a little bit older. Oh, God. Get out. Well, you still can't. Okay, I'm s I'm handling this a little bit better than I thought I would be handling this area with what we have going on here. But at the same time, though, I guess, like... It's not like as if I'm handling this area poorly either, other than when I'm jumping for no apparent raisin. Uh, okay, so... Nothing. 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 What about over here? What do we have? An elite monster. Mmm. <laughs> no. I think I will top up on my HP. I didn't realize how low I was. Like, even one hit is, like, considered pretty bad. We have found the way to the Black Bridge. I think that's the easy way out. I, I truly, truly want to try and find, like, whatever the new secret area might be. Whether that'll be easy to find or not is another matter entirely. Which I don't think it will be in the slightest. Oh, no, that was the wrong way to handle that. Okay, so we wait to drop down, go like that, and then we go up here. And let him burn to death, hopefully? Not quite. There we go. That was a good finisher. Er. Hello, Mr. Gorbachev. Ah, I could have handled that whole situation a little bit better. Could have handled it ever so slightly better. And perfect, okay. So there is another, like, one of these things. Where does this take me? It's like some new stuff. Uh, ooh, shop. Okay, this could be huge. Um, oiled sword gives us a plus one to strength. But we also take 1.15 damage with it, which well, I don't, I'm not a huge fan of. Uh, what about this? Blood Sword 5. Uh, like, it does seem pretty good. So is Hunter's Bow as well, actually. But I think I'm going to take the Blood Sword. Impaler has been doing us some good work, but I think we need a level 5 weapon pretty desperately here. Even if it doesn't have the range that, uh, some of our other stuff previously had. And you know, we'll just let those flames take care of that guy. 
it just barely takes care of that guy. I, I am honestly amazed. There we go. I will take the vampirism. Not because I think it's amazing, but because it's better than not having it, I would like to think. Okay, yep. And now we heal. Again. Because I am an idiot of a human. <laughs> yeah, let's uh, take the cursed chest in here. That seems like a smart idea. Yep. The move set on this is also just like really nice as well. On the blood sword. Okay, yep. Okay, yep. I did not fully grasp the situation there that I was facing. Ooh, yep, down we go. And we just, uh... He, di he didn't die. Get out, get out, get out. <laughs> and heal up with our last uh, potion there. Saying that with not a lot of joy, so to speak. Please just, like, die from the fire this time. Just barely. There we go. That's fine, too. That's all I was asking for. It's for you to die as excruciating of a painful death as possible. How about you? Are you going to die from... You are not going to die from this single one. Thank you. I... I needed that. Like a lot more than you realize. Are these guys like getting like that much stronger? As time goes on. There we go. Oh, hello. Okay. That's a lot of damage. Whoo. Hoping that they will both die here. Yes, they will both die. I hate that situation there, though. I figure we have to begin, like, pretty close to the end here of this whole sitch. Nope, that didn't pan out how I thought it would at all. Just die, just die, just die. It's not gonna quite die. What about over here? Nothing. Nothing. Okay, so that's to... The one area that I'm familiar with. Oh. Oh. Wow. There's like a lot of stuff over there that I missed actually. So let's pick up everything over here. Starting with like what's down here. Like the plus one to health for one thing and... And the plus one to skills. <gasps> okay, yep. Did did that just do what I think it just did? Cause if so, that's pretty cool. Fire damage is already like 
super duper worth it. And yeah, okay. Plus one in skills is like so good. I hope the new controller isn't too clacky for the mic. I, I have noticed that it is a little bit louder than the previous controller was. But at the same time, it's like, if you're able to notice it that much, I think you probably would have noticed the other one a lot as well. I would think, at least. And finish you off. Perfect. And then even better. Ooh, health upgrade for free. Yeah, baby. Is this my time to shine in the sun? I feel like as if it might be. Ooh. This may be my time in the sun. Okay, yep. That was dumb on my part, but not terrible. Okay, what else haven't I explored? I know there's other stuff. I know there's, like, that corner there, and then that stuff down there. So let's, like, maybe go to the far left stuff right now. There we go. Right, that's an elite enemy, which... I, I don't know. I could probably get away with fighting. Mm, what do I have right now? Yeah, uses up most of my gold, but you know what? If it gives me like a slightly better tactical advantage in certain situations, then sure. Why not take advantage of it? Oh, and a treasure chest. With a grenade. Which I will definitely use over the vampirism. Like, fire grenade is already way too good to pass up. So it's like, why the heck not? And then there was just the one other area I haven't really explored down here. Which I will implore myself to do now. <sighs> ah. <sighs> ah, la, la, la. We're fine, we're fine. Okay, yep. Yep, we're fine though, actually. Somehow. Yeah. And that's it for down there? Alright, so this is the first... <laughs> landmark episode where we actually make it to what might be the new area? I can't say with certainty if it's the new area, but it kind of feels like as if it might be the new area. Uh, yeah. The Fricon. Sepulcher. Sepulcher? H how do you... How do you... Fricon Sepulcher. Sepulchra? I'm going to get a lot of flack for not knowing how to enunciate that properly. Finish that up. Did 250 to upgrade that again? 250? You're actually out of your mind. Uh, I think I will upgrade... 
the balance blade? Yeah, we'll we'll start upgrading the balance blade, I think. Used up all of my uh, health potions there. And we're going to see how much of a pain this area is. Achievement unlocked. I'm not afraid of the dark. You must be the anomaly she's looking for. You've come adventuring far below the surface, fallen. Dark is the path your choices set before you. The light of the guardian colonnade, colonnades, colonnades will protect you, but for how long? Behind you, the big light, right there. <laughs> oh, that thing. Sure. Follow the light. So I can't afford that thing there, whatever that is. Okay. Uh, so there's like a, ah, oh, sealed 11 minutes ago. Are you actually out of your mind? Oh, okay. Hello, little goblin men. You are quite impervious to my fire. Ah, the mage men are back in town. Oh, they teleport. Oh. Nope. Nope. Not a, not a fan of this. Not a not a big fan of this. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're we're super dead already. <laughs> that didn't last long, but hey, we made it to the new area, and now I know I need like twenty nine thousand gold to pick up whatever that one thing was. Yeah, I think we'll call it an episode there. Thank you so much for tuning in, everyone. If you made it to this point in the video, feel free to support it in the form of a like. It helps me out a lot and shows that you want to continue to watch this series. And if you want to see more videos like this one, you can always subscribe to my channel to be notified whenever I upload any new content, whether it's of this or of any other kind. And until next time, as always, everyone, have a good one, and I'll see you next time in the <laughs> Dead Cells. I almost said Darkest Dungeon again. Bye for now, though.